Hey guys, what's going on? 6-7 Cliff, back to another video. So today we've actually got some parts in for the Cliff 2.0. Um, I actually wanted to do these on my other truck and I didn't. So we're gonna do this on this truck. So um, I always wanted to do, you know, the white switchback mirror lights. So um, that kind of gave it away. So we got some boost auto parts, uh, switchback lights. So we're gonna do an unboxing of these and gonna install these on the truck today. And uh, we'll see how those look come tonight. So I'm gonna get to unboxing these right now. All right guys, so we got these unboxed. Um, we're gonna go ahead and show you all what was in our package. So we got a Boost Auto Parts koozie. Uh, big shout out to Boost, I appreciate y'all. Um, we also got a Boost Auto Parts sticker and here are the Boost Auto Parts switchbacks. We'll open this up for y'all. So inside, we just went with clear because we're gonna do chrome and red on this truck. So these are the lights from Boost Auto Parts. Come in a very good package box. So here you have it. We're gonna replace those stock ones with these switchbacks. So I think that will be a super good thing to do. So super excited to install these and we're gonna get to install those right now. Catch y'all in a minute. All right guys, so we got the mirror out. All you have to do is take this piece out when it's in here like this, tilt it up, put your finger behind there and pull towards you and it should pop out. So this right here is a T15 bolt. You'll have to get you a torque set and unscrew that and undo this clip and then that should pull out and then you can put your new light in. So we're gonna do that right now. All right, so we got our T15, check it in there, loosen that up. So you get the point and we're gonna replace this right here. All right guys, so the old one is out. All, like I said, all you gotta do is take that bolt out and that comes off. So there we have it. So we're gonna get our new one installed. All right guys, these are on, lit up. Everything looks good. All you gotta do, we'll turn our turn signal on now. So those flash amber and then we'll cut it off and then light back up white. So super clean look and we're gonna move on to the cab lights. All right guys, so the cab lights were a bust. I didn't really understand um, that these new fifth gens actually have lights that are built into the cab light itself. So you can't change that. There's no way that you can change it whatsoever. So we're actually gonna have to order bulbs and we're gonna get that taken care of before long. So everything will be all right and we'll get that taken care of. And then we'll actually do an install video on putting those cab lights in. I think I'm gonna reach out to Recon and see what's going on with them. Hopefully they'll, you know, they might even send us some, who knows, but worth a shot. But anyways, guys, we will catch you all at, at night here in a little while. We're gonna show you all the Boost Auto Parts switchbacks and it should be pretty awesome at night. So anyways, we'll be back with y'all here in a minute. All right guys, so here we have the Boost Auto Parts mirror switchback lights. I'll leave the link for these below and y'all can go check these things out. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the turn signal on right now. And yes, this can happen, so be careful. So they're amber now, flashing. Turn them back off and they turn back to white. All right guys, so there you have it. That is the Boost Auto Parts switchback lighting. So anyways, I'm gonna be installing cab lights here pretty soon. So do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.